Hello. I have a new toy. Ta-da. Wow, that is too big for the whatever. You see, Akai MPK Mini Play Mark Three. She doesn't make a big deal of it on the box, but trust me, it's the Mark Three. The guy at the music store said so. Also, it says on the on the back of the box. Anyway, um, I'm not really equipped to do, like big fancy unboxings or anything, so I'm doing a little shoddy one, I guess. Um, cause I I I'm excited about this thing. And if I'm excited about it, oh my god, get in there. If I'm excited about this thing, other people are probably excited about it too. So I thought you might want to see it. Unboxings are fun, right? Everyone likes unboxing stuff. It kind of feels like Christmas or something. This is a very small space. I don't, I don't have like a good big space for stuff. Um, but it's in there. There's plastic stuff. There's this. Your hit song starts here cables and stuff oh it's in there with, with styrofoam everything nice and safe it is so small holy smokes i mean i like that it's small hey all right uh tape oh my nemesis oh, tape. Tape is fine. Tape is fine. I never want to cut the tape because I'm like, I can just peel it off. Just peel the tape off. Yeah. There we go. Now. Oh, it has more plastic. Oh, this, wait, this is, this is everyone's favorite part. Look at the, yeah, get the box. Everyone's favorite part, right? Ready? Ooh, that could have been a little more satisfying. That was pretty satisfying, though. I'm gonna put this back in the box, because I, I don't know, maybe I wanna... You ever keep all the stupid little things that come in the box? Like, what if I wanna put it back in the box later and put the plastic back on the keyboard and stuff? I mean, I'm just... Let me get this box out of here. Okay. I uh, don't really know what to do with this thing, uh, but I saw it. I wanted it. Okay, challenge number one. Turn it on. Wait, it probably needs batteries. It has, aha. you can plug it in, which is probably what that cable was for, but I'm lazy and not close to a plug right now. So I want to, there we go, there we go. Ah, uh, battery's not included, that's okay. I have just the thing. Where are my batteries? Here they are. We got some... <laughs> Wait, double A's, right? The double A's? Yeah, they're double A's. Got some heckin' fancy old any loops. Just put a whole, whole little box of any loops in there. And this one goes in there. And this one goes in there. Oof. And then I hope it's not like on, you know, when you're like a kid and you put batteries in something and then just starts making noise as soon as you get the blast battery in and it's always frightening. Boop. Okay. The batteries are inserted. Now there should be, oh, power. You can pick USB or bat. We have bats. So, oh, hey, that's pretty easy to switch. Okay. Oh, oh, it's on! It's just on! There's a... I'm sorry, my phone is is taking the video and it's very low. I mean, my fancy professional camera is very low. So, there. It makes sound! Yes! Make it louder, Max. Whoa. Wow, nice. It has pads for doing drum things. Oh, there's a drum! Shaking the whole table. Wait, you can do, um, full level? Oh! Except you can't do, like, ghost notes on here. Cause you just... You have to hit it hard for it to make less of noise if you want. Let's just do full level for now. 
Okay. It still says grand piano. I don't... Oh, drums. Ah! We, we have the standard set. Room set. There should be a power set. Whoa, that is powerful. Lex set. Oh, there's the 808. You know, I'm not used to hearing the 808 when it's not coming through a Game Boy. You do have to like... Oh, there's the clap. That's cool. We all love toms, right? Okay, you can also do note repeat, which is cool. You can tap the tempo. Oh god. Drum solo. You do have to press fairly hard. And turn off the repeat. There's an arpeggiator, which sounds really cool. Let's try that. Um, whoa. How do I make it actually do an arpeggio instead of just... Wait, are we doing note repeat still? for two minutes six minutes whatever um turn that off wait does this apply to okay i'm pretty sure that's only for the actual um these you hit it like a <laughs> like a bongo. okay um how do we do the arpeggiator if we do I made it sound brighter. I like that already. Octave. Oops. It's kind of hard. I'm reaching around the uh, camera setup, so please just appreciate that. Oh, is this actually... Wait. That's cool. Um. Oh! Okay, how do I make it do that, though? There's a button for, for that, I think. I don't know which one it is. There's also this cool thing. Uh, hmm, what do you normally do on things like this? So there's knobs A, B. So you can... it do different kinds of arpeggios like make it go down instead of up or sideways not sideways silly yeah sideways you can have it do like random stuff i don't know how to do that but i'll figure it out let's turn the arpeggiator off let's find a cool el grand el grande can you read that this is el electric grand but it looks like el grand piano honky tonk
Hey, that sounds cute. Honky Tonk, El Piano, Harpsichord. Nine. Okay, I don't want to dooms here. I like the clavy. Clavy. Lots of sounds. Glock. Glockenspiel. Why is this flashing now? This is flashing. You see this flashing? It's done flashing. <laughs> this one's still flashing. I don't know. Oops. How do I like... Oh, you, you, I, I did that. It's intuitive. You press both, it goes back to whatever the normal octave is. Cool. Vibraphone. Love some vibraphone. Marimba. Oh, oh that's cute. <laughs> oh, go check your phone. You got a text. You got a text on a different kind of phone. Centaur. It's a cent center tubular. Okay, I was looking for like rock organ. Now we're talking. Guitar hero. I was looking for like a synth sound. Oh, synth bass. No. We have two synth basses to change from. Choose from, I mean. So this thing is working. Okay, so this, for example. Oh, A, B. One's green, one's red. I hope B is green because it sounds like green. So it's either filter or attack. Oh, it's attack. Oh, that makes it take long. So now it's on filter. Whoa. Cool. I don't know what any of these things do, by the way. I don't know anything about synths, but I'm trying to learn. <laughs> Just trumpet. Cute trumpet. Muted. Muted trum. Trumpet, French horn, brass section. Synth brass. Ooh. Alt of sex. Cool. I'm just playing with all of these. Oh, flute. Even has like the vibrato in there. That's neat. Recorder. Bought a tenor recorder recently. Oh, I love pan flute. Sounds so like jungly. Oh, is this the? I've never heard of a shakuhachi before. That is cool. Hey, I think I need a Shaku Hachi. <laughs> what kind of whistle? No, I've never heard a whistle sound that nice before. <laughs> Ocarina. I don't think that's the right notes, but you know, whatever. Lead. Oh, now, oh, there, there it is. Oh, it's the synth stuff. Oh, now we're heckin' talking. Lead two. Whoa. Oh, what if 
we arp it now. Arp it, arp it, arp it. Whoa. If we do like... I wish I, I wish I paid attention to the video that told me how to do that because I don't know how to do that. I think you can hold something and do like a knob, but I don't really know how that works. Hmm. What if I do like this one loud? <gasps> you can have different dynamics on the arpeggio! I can do this one quiet and this one loud. Listen. Quiet and then... <laughs> I mean, it sounds awful, but you can do that! That's crazy. the weirdest finger positions. This thing is sick. I have no idea what I'm gonna do with this, but it's cool. It's freaking cool. The only thing it's missing is a looper. There's no looper. I don't know what I did. Yeah, they could have put it there, I think, but maybe it would cost a lot more. So instead, you just have to buy like a $200 pedal to go with it, and then boom. Maybe this could have been like a $400 thing, and they chopped the price right. They, they, they just slashed the price in half because it doesn't come with a looper. I don't know. Um, but there's apps and stuff, and. I realized that the main reason I wanted a looper, I mean, I want to do cool live looping. That'd be cool. So I will get a loop pedal probably at some point. But for now, I I have learned about the Stylophone Beat, which is crazy. I have a Stylophone. I should have brought it out here to put it in the video to be like, look, this is what I'm talking about. But if you know, you know. And if you don't, go look it up because Stylophones are really cool. But anyway, there's one that has like a drum machine in it, but it also does bass. It also does bass. So... I'm hitting stuff. Um, so I could have it do like a drum beat, like a, like a. You know, something like that. And then I can have it doing some bass thing, like some like. Oh, right. We have the. That's a cool bass line. Don't steal it. I'm going to use it for something. Anyway, that's cool. I can have it doing that with the, like, at the same time. I can have that looping on that, on that, that thing. And then, and then this thing, I can just be, like, doing, like, whatever, you know. Okay, I just, like, gave up on one of those notes. I just want to try all weird combinations now. Like, I never- I- I- that sounds cool. Yeah, anyways, um, what was I saying? I can- I can have that doing the looping thing, and I can just be, like, fiddling around with this thing on top. It'll be awesome. And also, I've got the Korg Monotron, like, the little itty-bitty- it's like this big, it's like this big, and- and it makes spacey sounds, and I could probably put this through that to make this sound all spacey, and have like spacey arp- arps and, and stuff. I don't know, whatever. It'll be cool. It'll be cool. Um, anyway, this was gonna be like a short little unboxing just to show you my- my new toy that I'm very happy with. Um, but it's 20 minutes, so if you watch this far, cool. Thank you. Appreciate it. Um, go do something cool and maybe, 
Oh, wait, I got to do the YouTube thing. Hey, if you got this far, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Like and subscribe and hit the bell and all that good stuff. But um, put, a, put a comment. What are you doing after you watching this video? You can go make some music. Go make some music. That'd be good. That'd be cool. Go make some music. Look how it's so inspiring. You do this. Whoa. Yeah, that's that's so cool. You can do that and and whatever. Um, go make something, or not. I'm I don't I'm not gonna tell you what to do. But if you feel like leaving a comment and you're like, man, I really want to leave a comment because that's what people do on YouTube, and I really I want to comment something, but I don't know what. Oh, you can comment. Here's some ideas. Uh, you can say, hey, I got this thing recently. I don't know what to do with it either, but this makes me want to go try pressing some buttons and turning some knobs. You know, that would be ideal. You could also say something like, oh, this thing sucks. Go get a, go, go spend more money and get a, a real synth. I mean, it says Akai professional, so this is professional. So just saying. Or maybe you could be like, I'm going to go touch grass because it's been a while. I don't remember what grass feels like. I'm going to do that. Or, like, I don't know, I'm just going to keep scrolling YouTube and looking for more stuff. I don't know. I, I, I talk too long now. I talk too long. Um, thanks for watching my unboxing. I hope it was fun and entertaining, and maybe maybe you learned something. I did. Like, how to make the arpeggios not just... I, I learned how to do this. And stuff, and that's really cool. So I hope that you learned something, too. And, yeah. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.